Well, this is the setting for our featured match today. Welcome to you. I'm Martin Tyler. I'm joined by Alan Smith. It's a pre-season tournament we're covering for you. This is the third group stage game for Russia Dortmund against Valencia. Well, it's been a good tournament so far. Plenty of really good football. I'd expect it to continue in that vein as these players get that little bit fitter and sharper. Quite a few changes for Dortmund. Dan Axel Zagadou plays with Omer Toprak as the centre backs and just one out and out attacker in the lineup. Valencia will go with this team today. In goal today is Jaume. Dakanam Jene plays with Mukta Diakabi in defence. Carlos Soler starts with Gonzalo Guedes in midfield. And they've got plenty of goal threat with two strikers in the attack. So the first half about to begin. Here is Dahu. Felix Paslak. Marius Wolf. Obama Yang. He fancies his chances of getting past these players. Guedes. Trying to find the opening, which would be so crucial. Now he could play it into the danger area. Valencia couldn't hold on to the ball. Aubameyang. Here's a chance for Dortmund to go forward. Aubameyang. Good clearance. Delaney. Mahmoud Dahoud. That's not what he wanted to do. A poor pass. Isai Kondogbia. He's got players helping him here, but he might go alone. A try run now. It's a goal. Valencia have got it. Well, they call it his weaker side. Not too weak, that. It didn't look that way, did it, Martin? He took a little chance there, and he's uh, really been rewarded for it. Let's have another peek at that goal. And Valencia are ahead. Inside. Danny Parejo. El said he said. Then he went to win the ball, but the result is a throw. A goal of a top class, really, here. It's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. And here's the goal again.
just widen the margin here to 2 0. Looking to open them up with that pass, but unsuccessfully. Going forward with real purpose now. Space for the shot. Wonderful finish. Three of the best. He's made them play. And that completes a wonderful hat trick. Well, a wonderful achievement. To get three goals in a team like this against opposition like this, it's a special day. It certainly is. For a special player, too. A player that uh, is of the clinical sort. And He's shown us that today. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Here is Dahoud. Impressive, in possession, passing's good, possibly dangerous. Well, I think they can nick it from him, but I don't think they can. Couldn't keep it in play, it's gone out for a throw. Now you need to be strong to do this, and a good touch. And the advantage rule applied to Valencia's benefit here. They've spread it out wide here. Now they've got the ball. He worked so hard on his heading. He needs to do a bit more work, I think. Yeah, and the keeper's waving that one by bye. Dahoud, Aubameyang, saw that coming and intercepted. Valencia enjoying the lion's share of the ball, no wonder they're winning. Sometimes you can have the ball and not be able to do anything with it, but this side have been quite the opposite, so creative and so clinical so far. Great chance! Very able to get his body in the way. Time to check in with Alan McAnally at Bilbao. About a goal in that game, Alan. It's a goal for the visitors. 40 minutes played, 1-0. Well, right on the spot there for that story, Alan McAnally, of course. But the cross could come in here. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang on the team sheet, but not really in the match at all. It's been very frustrating for him to this point. Just hasn't looked himself today. Looked a little bit lacklustre. I don't know if he's ill or not fit, but uh, certainly not the player that we normally see. Corner played into the middle. Well, it's come to nothing in the end. Read the intentions. He's got a chance to cross. Challenges for the ball. And that's the referee signalling for half-time, blowing his whistle, and it's 3-0 here at half-time. Well, what a player. What a performance in that first half, Alan. Everything that fell his way, he took, and uh, he'll be after more. What a hat-trick. really was a very one-sided first half and the team on the wrong end of that scoreline has got to show a bit of backbone now Ashraf Hakimi Felix Paslak this does look promising he's got support in the center and they've got it away from the danger being challenged here very good challenge. Definitely a throw in there. Condog beer. Rodrigo.
Guedes. The target. Players in the centre. Put away, but not out of harm's way. It's only rumour, of course, but Wolfsburg, we think, will get their man. Well, there's been so much talk and so much talk of a transfer fee around £40 million, which sounds reasonable to me. Milan have a decision to make there. Out into the wide areas now. Well, they look promising there in that wide area, but the defender's done well. Delaney. Here's a chance for Dortmund to go forward. Some players arriving in the middle now. Looking for goal now. There's still a long way to go, but it's a step in the right direction with this goal. Well, as a goalkeeper, when you get something on it, you're always going to be disappointed if it still goes in the net, and that keeper is a bit despondent. Another angle on it here. making a substitution and it's going to be a double change 3-1 the scoreline as we restart the game back here Delaney well, he wants to run at them with the ball it's good to see and he's in, and an opportunity to help their chances now. Bang, bang from them, they've hit the target twice on this comeback trail. Still more to do, but they've given themselves a chance. It's a goal that's easily taken, and they were caught out, leaving the goalkeeper totally exposed. He could do nothing, one against those two. No, he's uh, entitled to wonder where his defenders were there. And Barr bringing down the lad, he could do nothing at all, the keeper. Very good game, 3-2. Delaney. Good vision here. Teammates getting out of the way because they know he can dribble it here. And the manager's going to make a change here. Guedes. Given possession away here. He tried the back heel. Dortmund looking to create some much-needed late drama. Yeah, they are trying to uh, increase the tempo. Got to finish here. Nice oh, in there. My word, this game looked dead and buried. But they didn't think so, just kept on going. Yeah, they're back in it, all square. Well, he's not going to miss from there. He was concentrated, had his head down, good connection. And we can see a slightly different viewpoint on it. This is what we love about football, a goal fest. And we're getting it in this game in abundance. Condogbia. Danny Parejo. We've got ten minutes left on the clock. Substitution imminent now. And no one's picking him up in the wide area. This could be dangerous. Obama Yang. So he. Obama Yang! Well, it was the final ball to set up the chance, and it would have been, but for the interception. Not much time left now. 
And the supporters trying to roar their team for this decisive goal. Well, they've got some players that can make the difference going forward. We've not seen them at the best, but still time for that to change. Well, Alan, here's the substitution now. Well, got himself a hat-trick, yet his team are only drawing and his defenders have not been quite as good as he has today. Delaney. Four more minutes. Aubameyang. Ashraf Hakimi. Aubameyang guiding it through. Wonderful group of fans, these. It's a great occasion for them, and they're determined to make the most of it. Yeah, and I think if their team wins today, they will have a big part to play in it. They've got behind them. They've not always played well. The side hasn't, but the fans haven't wilted in their support. And the time to be added on here is a minimum of three minutes. Can put them in front here. in the game to a chance to win it yeah and you do wonder they're wondering if they'll get another chance now <laughs> Rafael Guerrero and it's ended in the draw as the final whistle goes when you play like he's played, you do expect to win. He's done his bit, hasn't he? Grab a hat-trick, and it's not often you end up not winning the game just to draw.